How to make drinkable water when the world's ended, the rivers are sludge, and your kidneys are sending distress signals. The taps are dry, the bottled water's long gone, and that puddle outside glows faintly at night. You're dehydrated, desperate, and one sip away from internal doom. Solution? Science. But make it dirty. Find a bottle. Or what's left of one. Slice it open with whatever's sharp and not radioactive. Stuff the bottom with charcoal, not from your last barbecue, but from actual burned wood. Yeah, scrape it out of a fire pit like a raccoon scientist. Next, add sand. Fine, coarse, doesn't matter. It's apocalypse sand. Take what you can get. Then a layer of gravel, because apparently nature loves layers. Pour that questionable water through your masterpiece. Watch it drip out like regret in liquid form. The charcoal grabs the toxins. The sand catches the muck. The gravel just looks pretty. Is it perfect? No. Is it drinkable? Mostly. Boil it if you can. Or don't. Roll the dice. Survivor. Science calls it filtration. You'll call it not dying today, congratulations. You've just bullied nature into hydrating you. No bottled water? No problem. Just sand, fire, and poor life choices.